Take a Source Podcast. <laughs> okay, so Take a Source episode 78. Okay. Hi, guys. Yes, ugly voice of mine. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyway, um, today is what? Oh, other. Oh, look at you! <laughs> 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 I thought she gave me a no, natural instincts. I thought she gave me a weird, ugly look, like no, her usual I self. Look at you! <laughs> but yeah, okay. Um, I don't. Today, I am the host for this episode. Um, I don't really have a topic, but something has been um on my mind. Um, dun, 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 dun. Lately, <laughs> when going on drives with my boyfriend. I've noticed that he doesn't speak his inner thoughts when he's driving. While me over here on the passenger side, I'm yelling. I'm being, what do you call it? A backseat driver? Yes, a backseat driver <laughs> yelling at the drivers for him. Mm-hmm. And he's like, babe, why are you talking? Why are you saying it out loud? Those are the thoughts that you keep inside. And I'm guessing apparently not many people speak their inner thoughts like I, we do. Well, I mean, I do that all the time. I think it just depends on the person. Is it? Yes. Yeah, I think it depends on the person. Because, I mean, <laughs> I know me and Liz, we voice our opinions with stupid drivers. All the time. <clears throat> and not even, like, driving. Like, sometimes, like, I'll be sitting there. And then, like, we'll be driving, and I'll sit there and be, like, nosy and ask him, like, I wonder if this and this and this. And he's like, babe, I, I don't even know what you're talking about. And I'm like, no, it's not a question for you to for you to answer. It was just me talking to myself out, out, out loud. He's like, and he told me, he was like, babe, I'm a guy. When, when guys hear a question <coughs> just out of nowhere, we're about, we're... Bound or not bound, but we're expected to answer the question that is being said out loud. Yes, that's like uh, Mike saying to me, I don't know if you're talking to me <laughs> yeah. or if you're talking to yourself. <laughs> I was like, do you not talk to yourself out loud? He's like, no, was like, us guys don't do that. And I'm like, really? It's like, I don't know if guys, no, I'll think about it. I don't know if guys do that. They talk out loud to themselves. No. Well, it depends on the person. Like, what I'm trying to think. Says. Yeah, because I'm like, that's literally your brother. I'm always like, what are you <laughs> thinking right now? <laughs> it's kind of like when me and Melissa talk to ourselves in the middle of the room, and then Matthew's like, are you talking to us or are you talking to yourself? <laughs> 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 yeah. <laughs> oh, maybe it is a a woman thing. I don't know because I, mean, I don't rem- I don't remember ever seeing Chow talk out loud like that, like to himself. Yeah, yeah. Because I'll like ask him like most rant like the most random questions. Like, do you, do you know if your sister uh, wears earrings? He's like, I I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't see her enough to do that. And I'm just like, oh okay. <laughs> and like ask him more questions. He's like, babe, I I don't know any of this. And I'm like, oh, well, you don't have to answer. I was just saying my thoughts out loud. He's like. Well, don't don't do that around me because I can't. I'm bound to answer your question regardless of what Maybe it you is. You should go, Molly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Do you think talking third person? Yeah. <laughs> but that'd be weird. You're already weird in his eyes. <laughs> oh, okay. So just make it weirder. <laughs> <laughs> make it a fact. <laughs> well, I was gonna say I've kind of seen stuff like that on on Instagram where I think it's like neurodivergent people do that which are people who are a little on the autistic scale mm-hmm. we do that then the neurodivergent <laughs> also includes like ADHD mm-hmm. and all that stuff too yeah mm-hmm. yeah and so i've seen stuff on instagram and stuff that people who do that are is it neuro neuro neurodivergent neuro, neurodivergent mm-hmm. yeah <clears throat> because they have that's how they process things. process stuff Mm-hmm. kind of thing i do so that, technically yeah. we are the, we are weird that's not normal <laughs> well then again i did look <laughs> online because, yeah yeah we're neurodivergent i looked online they did say people who have it like inner thoughts and inner voices 
is pretty common or not really that common but there are people who don't have that inner voice or inner are you talking about a inner like monologue the inner dialogue thing Mm -hmm. yeah so does he have one or you're saying like talking out loud i think it's just talking your thoughts out loud because not many people do that (laughs) yeah that's why I kill your brother every day. I'm like, what are you thinking? He goes, literally nothing. <laughs> nothing, okay? And I'm like, how is that even possible? He goes, I'm just not thinking about anything. <laughs> yeah, because funny. It's just weird, though. Yeah, for the guys. That's why I'm like, I, sometimes I'll see, like, my boyfriend sit there, and, like, he'll sit there, like, with a very, like, distinct face. And I'm like, what are you thinking about? He's like, nothing. And I'm like... <laughs> Your face says something else. It's funny because like, it's the other way around for me. Because <laughs> I'll just be sitting there kind of like blank staring or like, I guess I look like I'm an intense thought. I don't know. Associating? Yeah, I guess. Yeah. Most and likely. Ch- and Chow's like, Chow be like, it's like, what are you doing? How are you? What are you thinking? What's going on? You know? And I'm just kind of like, what? <laughs> yeah. He's like, what are you, well, what are you thinking about? Tell me what you're thinking about. And I'm like, uh, seriously, nothing. Mm-hmm. Nothing. It's just kind of like mm-hmm. in my head. <laughs> the funny thing is that whenever they break you off that inner thought thing, that whole ch- thought train is gone. Mm-hmm. So by the time they ask you what you're thinking about, you don't even remember what you're thinking about. So you're literally like, I don't know anymore. <laughs> but I-, I had it, but since you talked to me, I lost it. I lost connection. Yeah, we're totally no sounding signal. like neurodivergent people. <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Not in a bad way, but you know, like Anna says, it includes ADHD mm-hmm. <clears throat> and stuff like that. And I believe we do have a little bit of that. Mm-hmm. You know? mm-hmm. so. Yeah, and I think a lot of it is just us girls who go undiagnosed. <laughs> For we, so long. Yeah, because we don't know. Mm-hmm. Kind of thing. <laughs> so that's why I'm always like, I think I have ADHD. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Yeah. I do. I'm Som- pretty sure. Sometimes I talk, when I feel my my thoughts are racing, then I kind of like talk to myself. Like I have another Anna talking to that Anna and be like, <laughs> hey, can you like calm down? <laughs> like one She's Anna. like Spider-Man yeah. her <laughs> One Anna's like, one Anna's like, oh my God, we got to do this. And we got to do that. We got to do this. And then another Anna pops up and be like, can we just sit down? Yeah, like, what's, hey. Yeah. Can we chill? What's, what's yes. her name from Storks? The she- <laughs> <laughs> oh, the main girl? Yeah. Yes, yeah. She has so name. many versions of herself working with her. <clears throat> that is literally That's us. us. <laughs> <laughs> yes. So I would literally be like that. And then then it will be like me listening to two of me talking. And then I would be like, oh, wow, that's interesting. <laughs> Going back and forth. <laughs> talking. <laughs> Oh my goodness. That's kind of a. Um, so, when I was visiting my friend, I was in charge of the ox. Okay. Oh no. And so, my music was like different. It'll be like old school hip hop. And then I'll go to like um, like 80s music. And then I'll go to like um, like Bollywood. And I'll go to like mm-hmm. something. <laughs> Korean OSTs, you know? Yeah. <laughs> and then he was just like. Oh, you your playlist is very uh, eclectic. Yeah, he's like it's very just like out there, huh? I'm like, that's my brain <laughs> constantly. Okay, mine's like her too, but my brain is smart enough to organize those into certain playlists. Though, <laughs> nope, not me. I don't know how I feel today. Yeah, yeah, yeah but then, like sometimes I'll like like you said, you don't know how I feel today. One day I probably want Bollywood. Okay. I got a Bollywood playlist. Oh. And then one day if I want to do some old Chinese songs, then just go some old Chinese song playlist. <laughs> mm-hmm. Nope. Whenever I <laughs> Yeah. Whenever I hear a good song, I just add it to my playlist. Yeah. That's what I did, but then I had too many like songs with my like I playlist. Know, I noticed that. So I had to disperse to recategorize them. So all my likes are just K pop songs. I need to do that too. And then I had to break some pay K-pop songs to generations. Dang. Because there were so many that I liked. Your K-pop catalog must be big then. It, it's still pretty big. I haven't even gone through it. Damn. I probably have to uh, make another category for like third gen, third, fourth gen. Our 80s K-pop, 80s little, our K-pop connoisseur right here. Uh, I lost it. Okay, if you're asking about from 2019 (laughs) and up, 
I had no clue. Oh. Is that the fourth gen? Or is that third? I'm going to say probably between end of third, oh. fourth, fifth gen. I think gen. the only group that I actually like follow and listen to is Stray Kids. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that are still, um, what's the mm. word? Legal? Not legal, but they're... Of age? No. <laughs> no, I guess they're like the... <sighs> That I can be a cougar mom. On oh, too. yes. Yeah, mm-hmm. would be Stray Kids. Anything else, I'm like, okay, yeah, no, you're too young. <laughs> yeah, me, Stray Kids, too young. and probably 17. Everything else yeah. is... Yeah, 17. They're too young. Yeah. Like, Jesse, when she was interviewing interviewing one, one of them, he's like, yeah, I was born in 2002. She's like, what? <laughs> and she was calculating. She's like, 2002? And she's like, I was born in 1980, 1980-something. I think she's my age. I think so. I think so, around your yeah. age, yeah. Yeah, mm-hmm. she's about my age. And so she's just so shocked. She's like, <laughs> she's like, I shouldn't be even talking to you guys. Yeah. Kind of thing. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's like, I'm totally okay simping after Stray Kids and Seventeen and some of the BTS members that's been, like, coming out of um, military. <laughs> I don't like, see. I don't even keep track of that military stuff anymore. I used to back in the day. The only reason why I know about... Uh, what is is his name Nam June or uh, R M? Yeah, mm-hmm. it's because of this song he came out with with uh, Megan. With Megan. Oh, that's such a good song. It was Voice. such a good song. Yeah, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. that's the only reason why I know. And it's kind of like oh, one, two, okay. three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Mm-hmm. Yeah, no, I have, I Tell see. We are on our way. I don't pay attention <laughs> to all that anymore. Something like that. <laughs> but yeah, no, stray kids, stray kids. Yeah, but no. I was, but yeah, I was just talking about the inner voice because I caught uh, my boyfriend the other day. Because you know how I said that he didn't yell at the cars or anything when we're driving. But when we were driving into the parking lot to like Walmart, he started yelling at a, pa- uh, a pedestrian <laughs> to hurry up and walk over across. And I looked at him and I'm like, so you would yell at a pedestrian who is already halfway off the driveway, the driving area. But you won't dr- yell at a car who's driving really slow or doing something like very slow he's like yeah that's just like chow who doesn't honk the horn oh yeah um that bothered me too the other day too because i don't understand that we would have <laughs> he said we would have gotten hit but then he just went Vroom. and then i was like you could have honked you know and he's like did you want to die or did you want to <laughs> survive you know and i'm just like you could have honked, honked after the maneuver yeah. To let them know. I can see from his point of view because sometimes y'all's road rage. Yes. Y'all. <laughs> Why are you looking at me? No, I'm looking at all y'all. <laughs> y'all's road rage is too much. Y'all could get someone hurt. AKA Rod. AKA me. AKA Chow. <laughs> okay, first of all, I don't think my road rage is as bad as like Michael's. Okay, sometimes with Michael, I'm kind of like, dude, man, you're in a fucking SUV. You should not be driving it like it's a Like it's a Civic, <laughs> Honda Civic. <laughs> <laughs> okay so i'm like i'm literally holding on to shit and i'm like dude it's quit kinda, tailing this it's kind of like when he tries to squeeze between things and you hear your your little auto thing go beep 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 we're just like oh my god we're gonna die <laughs> <laughs> if you think that if you feel that way how do you think i'm feeling yeah i always have to be like well you know i just gave up telling him and i just go like this if it's my turn it's my turn <laughs> because like sometimes he'd be tailing cars so close yes that i would just be like god is it time <laughs> I would just close my eyes and be like, here we go. <laughs> because literally, and then like, it was to the point where I said it so many times, but I gave up. But then mom rides with us and mom would be like, you need to listen to Nya. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, that's right. Tell them. Yeah. Sometimes I'm like, dude, it's a freaking SUV. Quit. <laughs> quit tailing. <laughs> Which, no it it hasn't happened to him yet. But remember, I told you guys that. Well, I, you guys hear me nag him all the time. Yeah. Is that like, if you're not careful with my car, I think it's my, one of the defects of my car is that it will automatically stop my car and it will mm. pull you like by the seat seatbelt, oh, you uh-huh. know, as an emergency measure. But sometimes it doesn't work, you know? Mm. And so it did that to me and there was nothing in front. It always happens to me, which mm. thank God probably because it'll be too close if it, he was driving. It's giving you a warning to tell your husband. <laughs> it does it to me. The but passenger? Or no, while uh, you're driving. While, while I'm driving. driving. Oh. It's, it's happened to the passenger, too. Yeah, it's giving you a warning. Tell your husband to drive No, safe. but <laughs> I've been telling him. It's, like it's, it's all the late reactions before. from Michael. It's, it's like it's driving. Oh, yeah, I forgot about the other day. 
I know. <laughs> probably because literally I drove and then I was so mad and I'm like, this needs to happen to Mike because literally it keeps happening to me. <laughs> and I'm like, there's nobody in front of me. Why are you stopping me? Or like it will jerk and it it kind of scares you because it like it jerks the seatbelt. So you're being pulled like you're in an accident. Uh, and I'm uh, like, oh, and I was like, why would you, you do that to me? <laughs> Car? Why? Probably making sure you're paying attention. Oh, well, I am God. paying attention because there's like plenty of space in front of me. I'm not speeding. I'm not swerving. I'm in and out of lanes. But yeah, sidetracked it. But yes, y'all's road rage <laughs> is a little too much. Some of y'all's road rage can just be dialed back a little bit. Okay. That's like me and Tell Rod. I'm like, before you we go anywhere, you're letting me drive. We have to pretend to sign a waiver form, okay? <laughs> Just in case if you end up dying. Oh my god. What does that mean? That's what I've been like. It's like because <laughs> I was like, what does it mean? Nice. As I tell him, I was like, you know how I am on the passenger princess window? <laughs> That's me the same way on as a driver, but I'm actually oh. yelling. <laughs> I don't know. My kids seem to enjoy it because they'd be like, ooh, mommy <laughs> said bad word. <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's where the little one was, what the hell? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Why are you driving like that? <laughs> so funny. Like, I can't road rage as much as I want. So, like, my old car with the, what was it, Acura TL, mm-hmm. since the engine was a better engine. <laughs> <laughs> was it was it? probably a v6 it was a, yeah that's it was why. like yeah it was a, a better engine so i was able to um accelerate really fast and get out right but with the tl it's like hello fucking long <laughs> to think you could say you say that but my car is way. worse <laughs> than yours <laughs> 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 <on> the gas. <laughs> <laughs> that's how i feel like with my new car my mazda 3 <laughs> and i'm like dude man what the hell I'm was that? Think of her thing. <laughs> get, get out of my way. You know, if you don't know how to drive, then get out of the way. And then her stepping, <laughs> accelerating, and it goes. <laughs> still trying to. Girl, that's how I feel like <laughs> with my car. Because it's so, the engine is just so much slower. And I'm like, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> she did it as bad as like, mine is like worse than yours though. So yours to go, because yours is an eco car. Yeah, yeah mine, eco. mine's eco. So mine's a little slower, but I'm like. It's just that's that's what I need because yours go. <laughs> yes, I'm like move. Then I'm over trying to move over and speed up. It's just like. <laughs> I was like, you're looking at my car as a safe car, which is what I need because I would have probably zoomed over and get a car accident. Oh my god! That's what I was saying. Like, it's funny you say that, list because whenever I whenever I drive your car, I'm like. <laughs> I feel like that, right? I feel like it's going super fast. Excuse me. Yeah. But it's, not. but it's probably not. I don't know. But yeah, I just feel like it zooms really fast. Hers is probably better than mine. SUV. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, hers is faster than mine because mine would take a while because it t- it turns off when you break it. Yeah. <laughs> it does that. And I'm like, it's okay because I need that in the car because if I didn't have that, I probably would have been in like in my fifth car accident already. <laughs> Like you yelling explicitives, do the rock, <laughs> <laughs> drive around, <laughs> and then they look over at you like. <laughs> <laughs> at least our, your horn doesn't go. E. <laughs> 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 a little bitch horn. E <laughs> e. <laughs> Get out of the way. E e e. You know, I was like. I don't know what mine sounds like. <laughs> Mine's a good SUV horn. Yeah, mine is too. I lay it's on like that thing. It's like a mm-hmm. deep. Arr. So it doesn't sound like a. <laughs> oh my god, it reminds me of um, Fluffy. <laughs> <laughs> that reminds me the other day when I saw, um, you know, on, is it 51st? Is it 51st? No. Yeah, 61st. You know that. Um, was it 61st and Memorial? There's those geek square cars that are parked in oh, the, the parking lot. Oh, the squad? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. There was <laughs> I was turning to uh, 61st mm-hmm. from Memorial, and then I was coming. I saw one of their square cars come out, and it did a wide-ass turn to turn onto the 61st road. Mm-hmm. And it was just so wide. I was just like, ooh. And then I was like, watch that car pop. It go. <laughs> because it looked like a square, so it looked like a block, you know. <laughs> This is why I can't drive because I have like a wide imagination. <laughs> it's okay. I call Chow's car a toaster. <laughs> the blue toaster. But I feel like <clears throat> like driving 
I, I hate the, I hate this car. Sorry, people who drive this car, but Kia Souls. <laughs> oh my is. God! Yes. Oh, here is Kia Souls. <laughs> so little. Like I like. It's funny because when me and Rod will be driving around and I'll, and I, I'll see a Kia Soul, I'll be like, "Curse you, Kia Soul!" And he's like, <laughs> <laughs> and "He's like, what did the car do?" <laughs> he didn't know. He did not know. I was like, "We had it for rental and it sucked." <laughs> <laughs> Talk about that's a little that's a real life example of the <laughs> it's like hamsters drive it for a reason. You know? You can't yeah. Not those who actually drive a key so it's just that we had a bad the experience. Car, the car yes. itself. We but it was just we. funny because he was just like, What do you what do you guys yell like random thought your thoughts out? It's just don't y'all want to keep it inside? I'm like, Yeah. He doesn't but, know the story of the key of soul, that's why but it's like this, it just can't keep staying inside, you know? You just have to blur it out. You know, those inner thoughts can't it forever help, stay. It like, it's like, it makes us feel better. <laughs> yeah. You know, to get that out. <laughs> and it was tough. Remember when we said when we play games, we never went play to win. Okay? <laughs> we don't play to win. <laughs> play to sabotage. Sabotage! <laughs> Which I guess, yeah, like I guess not many people mm-hmm. think to do that, I guess. I can't win that you ain't winning either. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah, for real. real. Now that I think about it, that is more of an example of the F you. (laughs) (laughs) That's literally what happened. That's basically to sum up our story of why we have um, such a history with Akia Soul is that's what happened to us. (laughs) Trying to get away from people who don't know how to drive on the highway on a trip outside of the state and then they were like get out of the way they're driving they're only we were driving kia soul right <laughs> we were driving we were the driving the kia soul and we're like get out of the way and then we go mm. <laughs> that and also our <laughs> luggage is in the fit in the back <laughs> it's in the fit then i go mm. no like, like, like no. our big lug- luggage just wouldn't even fit in inside in the car, in oh, the yeah. car well, in the it truck. was a really so big had, luggage yeah, so we had to stick it in the back seat next to our next to me <laughs> I swear you were holding on to it too because it was slipping and sliding. So yeah. Was it you? Is it just? Was it just you three girls? <laughs> yes, yeah. we went yeah. to Minnesota for a J Park concert. Oh. And we, we got a rental and they gave us a Kia Soul, <laughs> and we were like, "Oh, okay, I guess this was, it'll fit." This was before he he had an OF. Okay, people. Yeah. It was before that. This is what 2019. Was it 19? Yeah, it was 2019. Pre-COVID. Yeah. yeah. Pre-COVID, yeah. <laughs> so we went there, and that Kia Soul was just... <laughs> <laughs> it really felt like if you went too fast and you turned, you would. <laughs> <laughs> That's why when I okay. saw it, I was just like, Tokyo to- it was like Tokyo Drift, but then it looked like it could have been... <laughs> 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 like, over but like I sat there, I was like, yeah. Molly, just keep driving. Don't even think about anything else. Yeah, so... Which is so funny because one of my uh, one of the people that I used to work with a while back, I think like we went on like a work trip or something and we came back and uh, we came back to the place where we all got picked up. And I saw a Kia Soul and I was like, don't tell me that's her car because it's the only cars left in the parking lot. And so I saw her car and I was like, oh, you drive a Kia Soul. And then she goes, yeah, those people that drive Kia Souls, they suck. And then now in my mind I was like mm-hmm. <laughs> I was like, couldn't have said it any better, sister. So I was just like, yes. Do you guys judge people by the cars that they drive? Kinda. <laughs> yeah. I do, I do. Like like, like it's just the same the type of soul. people who drive a certain car. It's the yes. um, Priuses. Yeah. <laughs> Priuses. Okay, but what do you guys Priuses. Okay, but what do we have what do you guys have against the Priuses? I I don't know. They drive really slow. Well, it is an eco car. Cause they s- drive like they're they're the thing, and like kind of like I don't know. Cause I don't have anything against the Prius. So. Well, I don't have anything against the Prius. I have things against the people who drive the Priuses. They're always the same type of person. Which is that's what I'm trying to understand. <clears throat> no, so I have a problem with driving. They drive very slow. <laughs> because of the type of person they are. Oh, I guess I'll be like curse you, Prius, or curse you, Prius. <laughs> And they'll look over who's driving and say, oh, it's those people. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of people? <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Uh, how, how would you describe them? Um, so. <laughs> it's kind of, to me, it's kind of like if you know, then you know. Kind of thing. Yeah. <laughs> oh. I'm trying to think because my old, old boss, she used to drive a Prius. And she was very. Um, <clears throat> stuck up. 
Kind of. She was kind of like on like her pedestal a little bit, but she did Mm -hmm. like her attitude was (laughs) fucking like like you have no reason for you to be up on that pedestal because you yourself is not that great (laughs) girl. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's the ones I don't know why, but they just even the way they drive. They yeah, they're act, better than everybody. Yes, they act like they're yeah, better. They, than they everybody. own the road, kind yes. of thing. Ooh, what was that? That's it's a, a gnat. gnat. <sighs> Sorry. Yeah, they always drive like that. Mm-hmm. So they take their time, make sure the presence is known. Yes, and, and stuff like that. And I'm like, yes, you're in the Prius. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Move. They can't. Yeah, they're move. just going to sound like, mm, too, because they're an eco car. <laughs> like, they always have to be, like, they always have to know everything. They always want to mm. stick their nose into shit. And I'm like, dude, just stop. Just stop. Oh. Okay. I'm like, Those I are the type of people that I know that drive Priuses. Oh, they look like that. Yeah. Or they're very, like, not really environmental, but, like, they're very, like, judgy towards you. Like, mm-hmm. oh, you know that's bad for the environment? You know, like, why are you going to do this when this is happening? kind of thing like yeah. very judgy and very i don't know what i don't know what the word is see that's why i said i don't have enough data to collect if i have a thing against priuses because i have equally <laughs> met people that are like that but then also yes. are not that too that's oh. why i'm like okay so i don't know that's why i was oh. asking you guys like a lot of them have the the people say this is a thing to people who have the coexist sign on oh, their car yeah <clears throat> and then a lot of priuses are the people who have the, the coexist. coexist sign oh so you're saying that if they have that bumper sticker they are the same as well kind of like that's, that's like, like a, a that's, that's like an internet joke, joke i guess you can say because uh-huh. people who have that sticker are a type of person i guess you can say what, what kind of type of person i'm trying to understand <sighs> I don't know how to explain it. I have to look on okay. internet on the on the internet. I have to look at it. Okay, because I'm just kind of like, if what you know, it? you know. But I can't. that's what I said. I was like, if you know, then you know. It's just hard to explain. You know. yeah. I can't if explain you know, it. You know. But I just do it just because I just know they drive really slow, and I look over, and they look like yes. the type of person that drives really slow. Okay, okay. And they'll take their goddamn time, and they know that they're gonna piss you off because. <laughs> That's that what stuff. they do. Yeah, because that's their <laughs> that's personality. That's just based on what I just observation when I yeah. when I drive through. Yeah. The, sorry, <sighs> people who drive Priuses. But <laughs> no, you're not. Sorry. <laughs> don't lie. It's okay. We can be honest here. I just don't have enough data to collect because, like I said, I've met someone that drives and they're definitely checking off every box that you said. But then I've met yeah. someone too that are like the complete opposite of that. Oh, so. it's like it's either the Priuses for me. It's like the Priuses or the Ford Focuses. Those people are the same people. <laughs> <laughs> what? I'm gonna Michelle? go to hell. Okay, but, but they, they are. are. They're the, the same, same goddamn, goddamn person. <laughs> uh, not on the four focuses. I mean, for me at least, I don't see. I don't encounter too much as much. Okay, I'm sorry. The four focuses that are like hash hashbacks. Oh, those people are the same people. Okay, <laughs> to me, a oh. little bit. So you have people problem with people who are. Hatchbacks, then, basically? <laughs> Herself? Me? I know! Yeah. That's what I said! <laughs> Dang, projection much? Why do you hate yourself so much? <sighs> that's true. I think you have the thing for, um, in, like, the uh, Honda Insights, too, and whatever else. Honda Insights? Cause they look just like the Prius. <laughs> I have to look at that car. I don't think I really know how that car looks like. Let me look it up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so you basically hate yourself. <laughs> That's yeah. so sad. The only problems I had were the Priuses okay, and first the of all, Souls. Okay, first Souls. <laughs> yeah. I do not. I like my car. <laughs> but I am not a Prius person. Please? Yeah. Oh, yeah, the wannabe uh, Priuses. Oh, I don't know. I don't. Oh, <laughs> see? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. I pointed oh. to that one. She don't like any other. She just doesn't like okay. any car that looks like her car. That's okay. not her car. She thinks she's better <laughs> than no, them. No, but this one though. This one though. I don't have any problems with people who drive that. It's just always the Priuses and the Ford Focuses. But she knows what those that car people, is. Yeah. yeah. Those people <laughs> piss me off. The only thing A I lot. have against certain cars is the um. Those like uh, what is it called? Those cars that make a lot of noise, like the like Mustang and stuff. Yeah, it's just the really like cars. I was gonna look yes. like your old car. That's why. That's <laughs> girl. My car is not a Mustang. There was a hole in the muffler that made it sound like that. 
Girl, you were scraping. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Bottom part of your car. My, when it was scraping. I was like, oh my God, she's yeah. here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, girl. That's how, I mean, that's how, that's all I had. It's, yeah. it's a yeah. ticking time bomb. It's, if not, I'll be walking everywhere. So, yeah. But no, like the Mustangs, because they were really loud and usually obnoxious. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah and then like transformers came out and then everybody oh they wanted the uh the mustangs the camaros the, the camaros the- yeah <laughs> it's funny the ones when they do the revving it's like rrr, 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 you hear like a oh, pop coming out i'm like oh they pop something <laughs> well i don't know because i think that might be on purpose i don't know it's usually on purpose because they have a little uh the the little spark, deal the little spark thing Jane. yeah nah, i don't but know i'll just tell but oh they pop something that just reminds me, that also reminds me of, which I find it so funny when trucks try to rev. And that when um, Mike and I went um, to uh, Panama City um, like a year or two ago, and there was this truck that they were revving so hard because it's like this little shopping square that you can drive around and shop. Mm-hmm. And so you can kind of like loop it back and forth if you want to show off your truck, I guess. Oh. So this truck kept coming around and i can see them from the ferris wheel because it's overlooking the um town square where all the shops are and they're revving 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 and all of a sudden their whole back bumper fell off <laughs> <laughs> oh my god and so oh, they're like is it you see that or something fell off and it like went clink onto like the actual road and i'm like that just happened and then they <laughs> just hurry up they got out of the truck Pick, pick it, it up, up threw it in the bed and then they left they and then they wow. just left and i was like that's, that's like embarrassing. that's like someone sharding on accident <laughs> <laughs> oh my god okay that just hurts so, so speaking <laughs> of sharding <laughs> it's funny that you bring that because there there was like apparently some comedian i forgot who that said like oh if you need to fart just spread your cheeks uh, and then, then it won't make a sound, uh-huh. right? Uh-huh. So I saw this um, video on TikTok and she was talking about it. She was like, that's a lie. I tried that. I shit myself. <laughs> <laughs> Don't. It's not going to work every time. Don't try it. <laughs> and then that comedian like, replied back to her and we're like, well, I, I didn't think that was going to work. It usually works for me. <laughs> But she, well, maybe you should check if you need to go to the bathroom. <laughs> no, yeah. Sometimes you should know. You kind of feel the difference. Yeah, you kind of feel the difference a little she bit. She was like, I shot myself. And I was at a dinner party. And I don't remember who it was, but she was on TikTok. You can look it up. But she was like, I shot myself. And it was a dinner party. And I tried to like wash my underwear. And I don't know why, but she freaked out. She tried to flush her underwear. And then like the oh. toilet was stopped up. And I'm like, girl, you know, at least just toss it in the trash or something. And go commando. Yeah. <laughs> But anyway, the moral of that was people really out there, uh, the more and more that I get older every day, really spread their cheeks to lessen the sound. And I'm like, if I do that, wouldn't my hands be on the poop particles that come out when the fart? <laughs> like, because you got to spread it, spread it for it to not make any sound. Yeah. So your fingers will be literally there unless mm. they magically know how to spread their cheeks apart without using oh, their hands that's a party trick <laughs> yeah, <I'm> like, <laughs> guess what they can clap <laughs> I'm, think, I'm thinking of going yay <laughs> that's what I thought too cause they said that they can open it so that's what I thought too imagine going to a party and be like does anybody have any party tricks? And I'm like, yeah, I'm doing it right now. They're like, who's clapping? <laughs> I was thinking of like mimicking it, like, like when you're talking, you know. Ew! <laughs> That's what I was thinking of. No, I was thinking of what Wally said. Go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <Ew. laughs> oh my god. <laughs> We go to hell. <laughs> we go to hell. Uh, I guess I attracted, it, but talking about cars and stuff. But yeah, people really do be spreading their cheeks, and I'm like, I just let it rip. <laughs> if I just let it rip, I let it rip. <laughs> me, me and had this conversation because in the new building there that we're in, it's such an old building, and so like the only single bathroom that they have is in the middle of the office. Yeah. Okay. Oh. <laughs> so, 
I can already see where this <laughs> yeah, is going. So, and so since we're, there's so many floors, he's always like, Melissa, my trick, if you need to go, number two, go to this floor because the floor is empty. And oh, you always got to have a, a poop bathroom plan. Yeah, she's like, yeah. go to this floor because it's empty. And because um, some floors, there's like locks on the bathroom that you have to scan in. Oh. Too, I'm guessing because of like homeless people. Yeah. And stuff like that. And so he's like, yeah, so this floor, um, there's no lock. So you can just go in and use it. And it's like really quiet on that floor. Nobody's there. Go. If you need to go use your thing, go, go do it there. I'm like, okay, cool. Tell me why I go. Yeah. And every time I go, a lady walks in. And I'm like, you lied. <laughs> You're such a liar. <laughs> well, I feel like I feel he, like girls. He wouldn't know on his side though. Maybe it's maybe it is empty on his side. Yeah, yeah that's what I was telling him. I was like, Fuck, I went down there three times, interrupted three times, <laughs> because it's a it's such a small bathroom. Because I think it's like only a three stall, but it's like really really like tight tight. Oh, you know, so you can hear everything. You're like, girl, I wouldn't care. Be like, I need to the go. acoustics. <laughs> Like, sometimes I'm like, you know what? I don't care. But sometimes when I'm like, if, if I had milk. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> and that's usually with coffee. Okay, coffee makes you go too. Mm-hmm. You know, mm-hmm. if it's one of those coffee days, yeah, I'm like, okay, I can't. <laughs> I have to go to another bathroom <laughs> on another floor. <laughs> I cannot. Um, I can't. Honey, are you okay? <laughs> right? And this yeah. Is thing. <laughs> and she goes, love you. <laughs> <laughs> Are you okay in there? It's like, uh huh. And, and then you hear all, and she goes, Ooh. Yeah. I'll wait outside for you. <laughs> and then at that point, I was like, Eric, I was like, you know what? It's okay. I don't know these girls anyway. So <laughs> I'm just going to go do my thing and then get out and just elevate her up. <laughs> oh my God. That's like uh, Ali Wong, which is, like, I recognize those shoes. <laughs> <laughs> you need more bananas. That's what she said. <laughs> you need to eat more bananas. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. funny but lucky for us that when i was working in the office they had a one stall bathroom Mm. like like a little further down but i think everyone like fights for that whenever they have to go like number two Mm -mm. so you because literally you would like hear the door open and if they see like the door close or like feet they're like oh and they close the door and you can hear it if you're in the stall (sighs) nope i think that's one thing i liked about working at the school Because on either side of the library, there's bathrooms, but I always go to the outer bathroom one Mm -hmm. because, like, no one ever, almost ever, you (laughs) goes to that bathroom. They always go out to the one that's like in the middle Mm -hmm. of the building. Mm -hmm. So I always like going to the one on the outside because barely anyone goes to that bathroom. (laughs) (laughs) So this is kind of like, huh? This is kind of nice. Weird that there's a window in here, but okay. (laughs) <laughs> at least it's better than our old building that we were in like when you're in it you're literally you literally feel like you're on an airplane oh because you're sitting there and it's just mm-hmm. <laughs> what? why is it shaking i don't know why it's shaking but on that side of the building for some reason i don't know if it's just old or if <laughs> don't know we're by a highway i don't know but it's just mm. well, it's just it's just, it's just <laughs> melissa no some of the girls they'll come in like into the office and they're like i think one of the girls she was like it feels like i'm on an airplane <laughs> and i'm like in the bathroom and she goes yeah and i'm like yeah <laughs> mm-hmm. i get you girl uh-huh oh my god but yeah what were we even talking about? <laughs> inner voices. Oh yes, inner voices, <laughs> inner thoughts coming, inner thoughts coming to light. <laughs> <laughs> so, with since your boyfriend doesn't have like an inner thought like that, how is it when he's visualizing things? I don't know. <laughs> That's like that one thing that they ca- like it was popular on the internet where they're asking if you can ima- like visually see things when you close your eyes or whatever. Mm-hmm. I forget what the thing is called. I think it's like it's a if it's a. a f- Fantasia or Aphantasia or something mm-hmm. like that where like you can't see anything. It's just black. I don't know. He says that he doesn't dream so until recently. That's so why I was like, I don't know. He doesn't fall into <coughs> REM sleep then. REM is That's what he says, yeah. but then he takes forever to get up. I don't know. 
I don't know. You don't always have. I think I don't think you'll always have to dream, though, bro. To dream to be in REM sleep. Um, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. But lately, whenever he sleeps or he takes naps, I've noticed when I try to wake him up, he has been sleep talking recently. Mm. Because <laughs> there was one time I tried to wake him up for it from a nap to tell him that I was about to leave. And the first thing he said was, no, you can't go. You need to eat more protein. And I'm like, <laughs> protein? I'm like, is that code for? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I, was like, I, was like, I was like, I was like, in my head, I'm like. Oh, you're nasty. <laughs> <laughs> you I sat there, that that I was like, in my head, I'm like, what kind of protein? <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> kind of thing. And then I asked him, I was like, you do know you asked me about protein this earlier. He's like, what? What are you talking about? And I'm like, yeah, you were like half asleep and you asked me or you told me that I couldn't leave without eating protein. <laughs> and he was like, I did? I was like, yeah, do you not remember? He's like, no. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's funny. <clears throat> and then there was another time I was waking up him up from a nap. And then I was like, you must have been dream- dreaming about food or something because you kept, you told me like, don't forget about the silverware and plasticware. And I'm like, huh? <laughs> and I was like, silverware and plasticware. I was like, <laughs> yeah, he definitely dreams then if he's yeah, that or he just doesn't remember yeah, he probably just doesn't at all. Remember. Yeah, that or he's just really really tired. I think mm-hmm. so. Yeah, <clears throat> that's funny. That's like whenever Mike wakes me up um in the mornings before he goes to work, and there's a couple times where I'm not fully awake yet i'm still like tired mm-hmm. so one time he woke me up you know like hey i'm gonna go and then i stick my hand out and i'm like it's nice doing business with you sir <laughs> <laughs> and then he was like he's like giggling he's like what <laughs> and then he just entertains me and he goes okay and he shakes my hand <laughs> and then i'm all like giggling i was like nice doing business with you <laughs> yeah <laughs> uh. Yeah, <clears throat> that's Chow too. He does that a lot. Whenever I go to wake him up, he'll just mumble something. Yes, and like his eyes will be open too, and looking at me, and he'd be like mumbling, mumbling, like talking to me. Yeah. Oh my god! <laughs> and I'm like, yes. huh? And he'd that's be like, scary. and then he'd be like, what? <laughs> I'm like, no, Rod, he'll just go just back to sleep. Talking to me, and he's all like, no, I wasn't. I'm like, yeah, you were <laughs> crazy, because y'all know how hard and quickly he sleeps he falls asleep yes mm-hmm. like a freaking rock that one time when we went to was it san antonio and he was asleep driving and we didn't know he was asleep <laughs> driving yeah mm-hmm. and when i was like you asked for skittles and he's like i did and i go you reached your hand to the back seat <laughs> i gave you skittles and you ate it and he goes i did i don't remember <laughs> and we're like <gasps> We could have died. <laughs> <laughs> Crazy fool. Oh, oh I God. swear to God. <clears throat> have you guys tried the passenger presence thing when you're driving and you know how your your man usually puts his hand on your thigh and stuff? Mm-hmm. I tried doing that in my car with him. And I'm like. Like while you're driving? When I'm driving. Oh, and okay. I was just like. I tried it and I was like. Babe, I don't know how you do it. He's like, why? I was like, my hands are too short. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> Like, I'll die. You're not like, fighting the T Rex like, claim. This, yeah, this is. <laughs> <laughs> that's why he sat there. I was like, babe, I really am a T Rex because I can't reach you. <laughs> and there's a, I would have to go like this. Yeah, I think my hand would be like this. Like, the reach of hand, I go like this. <laughs> and I'm like, babe, this is not comfortable driving. <laughs> <laughs> they got long arms. <laughs> But for real, you're not fighting those T-Rex claims at all. No, I'm just like, I can't reach you. I'm My sorry. My arms are short, too. <laughs> like, like, the furthest I, I could really go is, no the, upper body strength. is the parking brake, which is literally <laughs> right next to my leg. <laughs> that's Well, I, I since my Prindle is, like, in the middle, I make Mike's hand go on there, and I'm like, that's as far as I could go. i <laughs> 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 <Heavy> medium. <sighs> but, yeah, I just thought that was funny because I couldn't reach his leg, and I was like... Yeah, sorry, you can't be pa- the perfect passenger princess because I can't reach your leg. But, like, I could if you give me a little baby hand and I'll stick it out. All. <laughs> like, is that too? Is that? Or you give me a sticky hand and just go. <laughs> and then and just drive like that. <laughs> a sticky hand. And then you can hold the sticky hand? Yeah. You no, know, like, have the sticky hand on his thigh. Oh, yeah. And then I'll hold the stick. And then yeah. The end. That's the closest. That's the closest I can get because <laughs> you have long arms. It's stupid. But, I don't know. 
I thought I was the only one struggling with that. I'm like, how do you do it? Yeah, because <clears throat> I was also driving his mom's car one time, and her car doesn't have an armrest mm-hmm. or like nothing there at all. So yeah. I was sitting there like this, <laughs> trying to put like my arm on something because she has like no armrest because mm-hmm. she has a Ford Fiesta, mm-hmm. so it's like tiny, tiny. And so I'm like sitting there like, there's nothing here to stick my arm on. <laughs> and so, I was, but luckily I just had to drive car off so to just go into to the parking to his neighborhood. So it doesn't have a center console. So it's like, like a van, like a mobile van. <laughs> yeah, like, like a mobile van where it's empty. It's empty, but there's there's like a little cup holder, it's like down here. Hey, that's like mom's that old car, her old Lexus then. And then it didn't have like nothing on this part, like no armrest, no. Little oh, cup apartment. really? Mom's old Lexus was like that. Yeah, because I remember that her <clears> drinks <throat> and stuff would be in the middle, but I think she did have armrests, but then nothing, like no actual middle console on the top. Yeah, there was like no middle console, or nothing. So I was just trying to like put my arm on oh. anything. So you were, uh, but there's this? nothing there. <laughs> Yeah, like yeah. What we do with, we the, with the car. <laughs> with the car, <laughs> trying to rest her feet. That yeah, and then since her car is also like so small, like her things on the side here are like mm-hmm. moved too. So like her light stuff and her like and uh, the turn off the headlights and the power stuff, uh, they're all diff- They're all in a different area. Mm-hmm. So I'm sitting there like, <laughs> where is where it? Is it? <laughs> and then I had, he came up after because uh, he had to go pick up his car. And then he drove it here. I was like, how do I turn off your mom's lights? I've been trying to <laughs> look for it. And, and the usual spots, he's like, it's right here. It's like a button instead of oh. like a switch. And I'm like, oh. She literally oh. has a toy car. <laughs> yes. <laughs> wow. Wow. Oh, she must be short then, too. She's she's little like mom. Mm. <laughs> but she don't like to drive often anyway, so. <laughs> that in the foot. With the little arms. <laughs> yeah, because I was like. More like this. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Your little T Rex. <laughs> so cute, though. Yeah, because there was nothing there. Why would you? Were you? Are you just talking about the cart for your feet, or are you talking about in her car? You in her trouble? car, it was. You I have mean, troubles but, reaching. No, too? like I could reach everything without like moving anything. Because when I saw a uh, Rod driving it, it, says he's so like tall. His is legs he, are literally is he like, like this. <laughs> So is he like Mr. Incredible in his car then? Kind of, the yeah. Because that's how small it is. <laughs> and then again, her leg, his legs would be like frog legs because they're like yeah. so long and lanky. So the, his legs are up here. And he's like this. <laughs> yeah, but the way I guess her car kind of speeds because it's little. And so <gasps> I was just like, oh. It's a toy car like Michelle said. It was, yeah. Yeah. It was, like, it was like a toy car. Move it. You move move that it's, it's like it's really like <laughs> Y'all really don't like the little <laughs> ee. No, it's just funny. It's just funny because our one of our friends, she had a, what was that, it Corolla? Was some kind of, yeah, I think probably was. It was a Corolla, yeah. <laughs> and so she would, she would be so mad. And then she'd be like, ee. <laughs> yeah, she was trying to like, she was telling us a story that she had like a road rage incident. And she was trying to yell at them. And she'd be like, oh my gosh. And then she's like, yeah. And then I honk the horn and then you hear, E. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> she's my little bitch horn. <laughs> <laughs> and she was like, they're lucky that it's just a little horn like that. Otherwise, if it wasn't, it would match by I was mad. <laughs> Otherwise, it just sounded E. <laughs> but you can't be taken seriously with that little horn. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> uh, I jokingly sometimes ask Rob to him, like, what does your car, car's honk sound like? You know, because I never see you use it. <laughs> yeah. How does it sound I was like, like? Is it like a little honk honk, you know, or like a loud, like regular SUV? He'll just be, he'll like smirk, be like, no, I think it's just a regular SUV honk. And oh, like, so it's like a honk. Yeah, but I've never seen him use it, so. Like I think that. the little, I think those little cars that go ee ee are cute though. <laughs> <laughs> Not for me to drive, but I wouldn't think a Corolla would sound like that. I think it's a smaller was it an Corolla, older one or something. Or was it a different car? No, it could, no, it was her Corolla. Because that's all she had, right? Yeah. Yeah. This is before she it got it into a, a car wreck. Oh. Yeah. My first car was a 97 Corolla, and my horn did not <laughs> sound like that. Oh, we know that, because yours was like, yeah. it, it, wasn't, it wasn't that old. Oh, okay. Because yeah, I, 
Yeah. I, I want to say maybe like two, 2010, 2011 Corolla. Uh, Probably, yeah. Yeah, because I think yeah. it was the same one as um, our friend who drives the blue Corolla. Mm -hmm. I think it was the same year. Oh. So hers also is a eh, eh. I don't know. I don't know, know about heard about if, or I don't know about his. Defect. His was the blue Corolla. I don't know it, what his I just know like. that hers sound like that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> because I think one time she did show us and I was like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> and she goes, yeah, see? Now you know why I was yelling? And then when I, I don't try to press the horn anymore because <laughs> it makes me not sound serious. <laughs> like I'll be coming out and be like, get out of the way, losers or suckers. And then I don't press it because it's embarrassing. <laughs> and I was like, sure. <laughs> It's like the it's like the Chihuahua basically. <laughs> oh, the Chihuahua version of cars. Yeah. Or, yeah. <sighs> they think they're all bad and shit, but they're like <laughs> <laughs> little old big things. Uh, <laughs> oh my god, that's funny. Wow. Woo. Gosh. Well, okay. Yeah, that's all I had. It was <laughs> my thought was and knowing us undiagnosed ADHD we got sidetracked <laughs> plenty <Yes>. of times <laughs> 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 oh my god sounds like the sorry it just sounds like the um what is that old cartoon um the WB cartoon where talking you're... about the road runner yes <laughs> 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 yes <laughs> I was like, that's what it sounded like <laughs> well now I can insert the sound for it then <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah that's all I had in my mind yeah, it's like, do y'all have inner thoughts? <laughs> or is it just us? us. Or at least speak out their inner <laughs> thoughts. Because apparently not many people do that. Yeah. Or at least men that I know of don't do that. I don't know. Well, so. I guess we'll see. <laughs> yeah, well, this is the end of my episode. And you guys have the rest of the... Good, the have a rest... Good rest of your day. <laughs> 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 All here was glug, glug. <laughs> <laughs> My brain was working faster than my mouth could have hey. <laughs> Okay bye. Okay. <laughs> bye. But bye.